What's good, YouTube? It's your boy D Money here, back with another banger video, man. And today, as you guys can see by the title, man, they hate that you're not threatened by them chosen ones. Before we get start this video, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. A lot of you guys are watching the vids, but aren't subscribed. Go ahead, hit that subscribe button. It helps support the channel. Also, guys, we are doing a giveaway at 15k subscribers, guys. All you guys gotta do is hit that subscribe button, hit that post bell notification, and you win in like swimmer. You dig? Comment down below what you guys want to see next, and I got you guys. You guys have been showing me so much love, and I really do appreciate that. Now, before we start this video, guys, like I always state, take everything that I say with a grain of salt. My perspective might change a day, two days, a year from now. Who knows? We're constantly growing. And if you're not growing, then what are you doing? Also, guys, I love hearing the stories, the messages. You guys are such a big inspiration. When I read the comments, I literally see the positivity, the growth. I literally have the best community on YouTube. And if you guys have something more personal to tell me, let me know on Instagram. I do respond. I might be a couple days late, but I do respond. And if you guys do not agree with what I'm saying, please, please let me know in the comment section down below. I'm understanding. I'm understanding. I got an open mind. This is an open-minded channel. Now, check me out. Listen. Hear me out, man. In one of them videos. You feel me? Because a lot of y'all go through this. It don't matter who you are. As long as you are yourself, bro. People are going to be threatened by you. As long as you do what you love to do, people are going to be threatened by you. As long as you stay out the way and you don't care what everybody else is doing, what everybody else has, people are going to hate on you. You feel me? And it is what it is. Ladies, y'all know how y'all y'all know how it is. When you just chilling, you doing your own thing, you in the gym, you working out, you looking good. You got the girls that hate on you. you. You you spiritually, physically, mentally, you know what I'm saying, in tune with yourself. Ladies is gonna hate on you. You feel me? When you just dress the way that you dress, you got your own style. You know what I'm saying? Some of y'all know how to dress up. Y'all know how to wear basketball shorts. Y'all know how to wear gym shoes. But y'all also know how to put on the heels. Y'all don't gotta wear makeup all the time. And some of you guys that do, you know how to put on makeup really, really well. But you do your own thing. You don't follow the trend. You you do your own thing. You dress the way that you want to dress, and people go hate on you for that. They threaten because you like they they see that they got all the nice clothes. I don't know if y'all ever noticed this when you was in high school, when you was in middle school. You know what I'm saying? You had certain people that was just really obviously when you was in school. You you was like, damn, bro, I wish I had all these things too. But then you had those certain kids, bro. It was like one or two. It was, it was a few kids that didn't have everything, but they were still happy with what they had. Right? They were still cool with what they had, right? And they they didn't really trip. But you always notice that, that that popular kid, that that kid that had everything. They had the nice shoes, they had all the J's, you know what I'm saying? The girl that the, the girls that was wearing the makeup, because I seen it. We was in school, I seen it, you know what I'm saying? I was cool with everybody. You know, I had a bunch of acquaintances, you right? But I would see the girls. There was some girls that wouldn't wear makeup, and then there was some girls that would always wear makeup, and the girls that wore makeup would always get pissed off at the girls that didn't. Because even though they didn't have they didn't have makeup on, the, the, the girls without makeup, you feel me, they would still get the guys. They would still, you know what I'm saying, be be cool with all the people. You know, you ever had that 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 one, it's the it's the real popular girl. And she want this guy, right? She want this guy. And 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 y'all see it in the movies. She wants this guy, but it's that nerdy girl. She's nerdy, but she's not really nerdy, but she's real cute. She's real, you know what I'm saying, beautiful, smart, you know, intelligent. My bad guys, but listen. That one guy that everybody wants, he end up choosing the girl that's like that nerdy, she don't wear makeup, she's just chilling by herself, she's doing her own thing. And everybody, everybody like mad at they they hating on her because they like, why is why does why is he why is he messing with her rather than messing with me? I I got all the makeup, I look good, you know what I'm saying? I got the flat clothes, I got all this. But she's just like everybody else. Whole time you got this one girl that's just doing her own thing. She by herself. She vibing. She chilling. You feel what I'm saying, fellas? Y'all ever notice that? You, you, just be honest. The the guy that has it all. I'm talking about the money, the car, the cur the girls. You know what I'm saying? Some people just literally get all these things, and don't 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 get it twisted. Cause some of you guys, you may not have all those things. You may have a little cash. You might have a nice crib, but you're not able to go out and spend money like that because you know you got bills to pay. You got certain things to take care of, right? But you happy with what you got. You happy with what you have. And you got this one guy that's like, bro, you, you mad because you can't do what I do. You mad because I can't you can't come out and, and spend money like I spend money. 
You know what I'm saying? Whole time you happy with what you have. You got your girl on the side. You just chilling. You got your own girl. He out there with a bunch of hoes. Don't get it twisted. He out there with a bunch of girls. My bad for calling him like that, but you call it what it is. You feel me? It's a difference between women, ladies, and, and hoes. You feel me? It is what it is, right? He's He has everything. But you have what you want. You have what you want. You have what you need. And, it, and you're okay with what you have. And, and that person is like, why aren't you threatened by the lifestyle that I live? Why don't you care about it? You know what I'm saying? You're just doing your own thing. You Why why, why are you like that? And whole time you're just being you. Whole time you just, you, you have what you have. You have what you want. You have what you need. And, and a lot of people feel threatened because you don't want what they have. You don't want what they have. You don't want the lifestyle that, they, that they're living. You don't want, you know what I'm saying? And even if you do have the money, even if you do have the nice car and the clothes, you still live a different lifestyle. You don't follow the trend. You don't follow that wave. Because a lot of you guys, let's be honest, some of you guys got it like that. But you portray as if you don't. You portray like, okay, my life, like, bro, I, I want to live a simple life even though that you got it. Then you got some people that want to do what they want to do. You know what I'm saying? But materialistics isn't always everything you feel me having that girl having that what you call it on your side you know what i'm saying not behind you but on your side because if you fall over you know what i'm saying she can catch you vice versa right ladies fellas continue to be yourself man continue to be yourself a lot of people really are threatened that you don't you know what i'm saying they 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 they, they mad because you're not threatened by their presence and my bad, it's all windy. It started getting all windy out of nowhere. But a lot of people are a lot of people are are, are are feel like, why aren't you threatened by what they have or what they're doing or what their what their life is? You know what I'm saying? Especially on social media. I'm gonna keep it a buck with you. My dog is tripping. You feel me? But especially on social media, a lot of people literally like to glamorize their lifestyle. You feel me? Whole time it ain't really what it seemed. I told you guys this all the time. Take a break from social media sometimes. Take a break from this stuff. Take a when when I, when when you go on a fast, it ain't always about the food that you eat. It's about social media. Taking a break from computer. Taking away from you know Facebook, uh, Instagram, Twitter, whatever you know. what I'm saying that can keep or TikTok that can keep you scrolling for hours and hours and hours upon. You feel me? Everything ain't what it appears to be. The fake get the love, and the and the and the and the, and the real get the hate. I've been telling y'all this for months. I've been telling y'all this for years. I've been true. I've been, I've been told this since I was a youngin. You feel me? And, and you can see it now that you, you when you get when you become older, you start to really see it. Those that really genuinely have good you know love for people and on this on this earth, those that are actually trying to do good by this earth. Those that are trying to do good by others usually get the hate. Those that usually speak the truth usually get the hate. But, you know, those that follow the trends, those that, that, that want to lead you to a different path, you know what I'm saying? They get the love. Like I say in every video, take everything with a grain of salt also. You feel me? Take everything with a grain of salt because what I'm saying could be wrong. But you got to do your own research. You got to go within. You got to grind yourself. You got to, you know what I'm saying? Tap within. Now, I love y'all, bro. You ain't got to be like everybody else. They really mad that you're not threatened by their life. They really mad that you're not threatened by what they show you on Instagram. Because everybody ain't always happy, bro. Every and, 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 and everything ain't what it appear to be. You feel me? So listen, man, take care of your mind, your body, and your soul. Take, uh, go outside, get some sun, get some nature, drink y'all's water, eat y'all's fruits and vegetables, plant y'all's foods. If y'all can't, so be it. Just make sure y'all eating home-cooked meals. Y'all been smashing that like button. I really do appreciate that, man. I try to get 300 likes in this video. We are doing a giveaway at 15K subscribers, guys. All you guys got to do is hit that subscribe button, hit that post button notification, and you ran that like swimmer, you dig? I got the pranks. I got the vlogs. I got what you need. All you need to do is subscribe to D. I'm out of here, man. Peace.